Good morning and welcome to the lecture session. In this video, I am going to explain about the more number of problems in the tutorial 2. In the last class, I have explained uh, the problems on Taylor series and the modified Euler's method. And in this video, I am going to explain about the Milnes method or uh, Milnes method and the Adams Bashforth method. So let us solve the problems in the Milnes method. If dy by dx is equal to 2 e power x minus y, y of 0 is 0 and y of 0.1 is 2.010, y of 0.2 is 2.040, y of 0.3 is 2.090 find y of 0.4 correct up to four decimal places by using Milnes predictor corrector method and Adams Bashforth predictor corrector method. So the same problem I am going to solve by both the methods that is Milnes as well as the Adams Bashforth method and before doing that the table we need to do that table is common for both the methods. Let us first tabulate what all the x naught value x values. X values are nothing but which is there in the bracket 0, 0 0.1, 0 0.2 and 0 0.3. So I have respectively tabulated and we need to compute what is for 0.4. This has to be found. Okay. Y values are respectively given by 2, 2.010 2.040 and 2.090 this is being tabulated and we need to compute the y dash values by using the given formula how to calculate that it's very simple that see if we want to calculate y naught of dash y naught dash how do we calculate 2 e power x that is 2 into e power x naught minus y naught. What was x naught and y naught? 0 and 2. Therefore, we are getting 2 e power 0 minus 2. Okay. So, e power 0 is 1. 2 minus 2 will be 0. This is what has been written here. Okay. Similarly, we will calculate what is y1 of dash. How to calculate y1 of dash? In the place of x0 and y0, we are substituting x1 and y1. Here it will be x1, here it will be y1. So what was x1 value? 0 0.1. Okay, 0 0.1 it is. And the y1 value is 2.0 uh, not 1, not. 0, 1, 0. Okay. So, on simplification, we are getting 0 0.2003. This is y1. Uh, this is y1 of dash. Okay. Similarly, we are computing what is y2 dash, y3 dash and so. Right y3 dash up to y3 dash only we have to compute don't compute a y4 dash because we don't have a y4 value this y4 value is computed by using the predicted method so the predictive formula says y4 of p is equals to y0 plus 4 h by 3 into 2 y1 dash minus y2 dash plus 2 y3 dash which gives us 2.1623 and y dash that is 2 e power x minus y. That is 2 e power x4 minus y4. y4 is nothing but this value. Okay. So x4 is 0.4 and y4 is 2.1623. This on simplification gets 0.8213. Now let's take the corrector formula. The corrector formula is given by y4 of c. So y4 of c if we want. This is the formula y2 plus h by 3 into y2 dash plus 4 y3 dash plus y4 dash. Respectively, these values are substituted in this to get 2.1621. Hope it's clear. So, once only we have applied the corrector formula. Now, 
Adams Bashforth method. In the Adams Bashforth method, again, the formula for the predictive method is y4 of p is y3 plus h by 24, 55 y3 dash minus 59 y2 dash plus 37 y1 dash minus 9 y0 dash. So y4 of p is given by 2.09 plus 0.1 by 24 into 55 into 0 0.6097 minus 59 into 0 0.4028 plus 37 into 0 0.2003 minus 9 into 0 which gives us 2.1616. Now y dash is given by 2 e power x minus y. So let us compute what is y4 dash. Then we are getting 2 e power x4 minus y4 which on simplification 0.822. Now let us use this in the character formula. So the character formula is given by y4 of c is nothing but y3 plus h by 24 into 3y4 dash plus 19y3 dash minus 5y2 dash plus y1 dash. Substituting all these values in the formula we get 2.1615. This is the correct formula we have taken. Now, the following table gives the solution of uh, 5x y dash plus y square minus 2 is equals to 0. Find the value of y at x is equals to 4.5 using the Adam Pashport predictor and corrector formula. Here the table has been given already. That means the x0, x1, x2, x3, x4 has been given. And y0, y1, y2, y3, y4 has been given. Next value that is y5 has to be computed. So previously we have computed y4. Now we need to compute y5. Okay. So if you want to compute the y5, the previous four values that is from x1 to x4 only should be considered. Okay. Consider y dash is 2 minus y square divided by 5x and h value is 0.1 because the difference between the successive values of x is 0.1. Therefore, h is 0.1. Let us compute the table. x0, x1, x2, etc. has been given. Now, y0 values are also given. y values are also given. Let us compute the y dash values by substituting the respective x0, y0, x1, y1 x2 y2 x3 y3 and x4 y4 to get y4 dash etc okay now with these values let us formulate the predictor formula here instead of y3 we are writing it as y4 so uh, see the formula difference here y4 plus h by 24 55 y4 dash minus 59 y3 dash plus 37 y2 dash minus 9 y1 dash which on substitution and simplification what we are getting uh, we are getting 1.023 okay so with this value 1.023 we will compute what is y dash so y dash is given by y phi dash which is 2 minus y phi square divided by 2 x phi so we are getting 2 minus of y5 square is 1.023 the whole square divided by 2 into x5 that is 4.5. So on simplification we are getting 0 0.0424. This is the predicted value. This is the predicted value and from there we have computed what is y5 of dash. This value will be used in the corrector formulae. So the corrector formula gives 5 y5 of c is equals to y4 plus h by 24 9 y5 dash plus 19 y4 dash minus 5 y3 dash plus y2 dash. Substitute the respective values. So on substitution of these values that is y4 h is 0.1 y5 dash is 0.0424 and y4 dash is 0.437 and y3 dash is 
zero four five two and this is point zero four six seven. Now on simplification we are getting one point zero two three. Okay, so y of four point five is one point zero two three. If they have asked us to apply the corrector formula once again, this will be applied wherever this value that is y phi of c will be applied uh, i mean using this y phi you have to again compute what is y phi dash and then do the correction again that is the second correction thank you